back day after day, and Richie denies it. Imagine that, the guys, the two big black men. I hear you, I hear you coming over a little bit. And Richie uh, played it off like he was getting... Hey, 757, your video gate is up there, sir. That video gate is on the Pistol Channel asking for the title with 10-7. Hey, I hear you too, Richie. I hear you now. Pay attention. You're not supposed to hear me over that crying fag in Manhattan. 757 with the wave around your quarter, I'm gone. See, I hear you, Richie. I got a copy of it. I got a copy of it. He's in the back. He's got a copy on the page. He's in the back. He's in the back. Roger right on, Eddie. Roger right on, Brooklyn King. Roger right on, 757. I'm 107 and go. See what it is. That's crackhead talk. And that's why I warn people out here, before you bring your radio to crackhead Richie, listen to the way he talks. Listen to him. The guy actually thinks he's marrying Sade. He says he's a suspended cop without pay for 20 years. Anyone on the job will work. I told you I hate to hear fags cry. I told you I hate to hear fags cry, and this is all Eddie's fault. This is all Eddie's fault because Eddie can't say, well, Mr. Enforcer, you, you did start this whole thing. Why don't you go try to finish it? You know what I'm saying? Uh, like I said, man, I told them if they don't know how to finish it, don't start it. I told them they ain't nowhere prepared to finish. You hear them today. You hear them. Every time they come to that sidewalk, they're home crying like a baby that night singing a different cop tune, I'm gone. A deranged, uh, psychotic individual that smokes crack and K2 could come up with stories. Except Mr. 2-5 and Blow. Mr. 2-5 Blow never came out from behind his mic. He do be smoking crack and doing dope. That's why he won't meet for the piss test. I'm gone. I just had the switch so you didn't hear Richie Barr crying. I hit the switch and uh, I, I want to make sure no one ever... And you're still getting crushed. No, I only heard you that after that. After that, when you touch the switch... When you flip the switch, that's it. I didn't hear nobody else. All right, just waving a hand to the channel. Waving a hand to the band. No problem. No problem, 757. You have a good one, brother. He wants to cry on your shoulder some more. What happened to those two big black men under the covers, Richie? Did they go back? Are they still working with the, uh, with the FBI? Are they still with the Bureau or what, Richard? They're undercover, guys. Boy, I tell you, I'd like to know what video gate he heard. Uh, yeah. It's all right, Richard. We understand, Richard V. We understand, Richard. Yes, we do. We sure do understand you started something you're too scared to finish. We sure do understand that only you hear these things. We sure do understand there's no video stating that. Richie, enjoy my show. Enjoy my crying homos. The king of New York City. They got kicked off every other base channel. So they want to hang with Richie on the business channel. I don't mind. It's Friday night and I'm going out. Cry off. Yes, Eddie, it's cleared by the fucking cuckoo clocks in the basement, Eddie. Capilano, it's time for your meds. Let's go. Cuckoo. Cuckoo. Time to grease Weezer. Richie, you need to take your meds for real. To fuck up. You know what his meds is, right? His meds is that fucking weed, man. Rolls it up real tight. Dips in the smokes, man. Two points from a psychiatric ward. You know that, right? He lets that weed get to his head. The holy god. Yeah. Half a block from that, he's his. Uh, oh yeah. He's he's got it made. Oh yeah, that's why he's known in the neighborhood as Crackhead Richie. Everybody knows him. He's probably trying to say that uh, today's weed, today's grade of marijuana is a lot more potent than what it was years ago, you know, 15, 20 years ago. Yeah, because everybody became a chemist and did all kinds of shit to it, I guess, you know. Time for your medication. That's all, man. Yeah, they mixed up all, all kinds of crazy shit, man. Fucks up in the head. Now, think about it. The Chinese make that synthetic shit, that K2 shit, and can imagine what it does to you, you know? I wonder how the shit is that they get from these uh, labs. Like, I know there's a GW uh, pharmaceutical company that's on the, actually on the stock market that uh, grows.
Burroughs pot and does all kinds of shit with it for medicine. I wonder what their shit tastes like. Really? Wow. Yo, Nitro. Yo. So what that mean? Yeah, they were doing shit for like... Uh, yeah, shit is gone. <laughs> a couple of different kinds of conditions, you know? And that was all uh, marijuana-based they were doing. see what it did to Enforcer, it had him stand out here and tell you he's got a videotape of me and him smoking his drugs, okay? It, it, it got Enforcer to say that, that I puncture my skin like he does. Pay attention out here, dude. Hardcore drugs are fucked up. Richie a pothead. Let's no denying that, bro. But then again, Richie's not claiming to be you, man, either. You know what I mean? So basically, it's a whole different ballgame for me, man. But nevertheless, do pay attention. Big money here dot playlist on YouTube. Uh, you know, it just dumbs, dumbs people down. You know what? You got to go to Colorado where it's legal and get like a, a wise potato chip wrap or something. You'll make a fortune. That's where everything got rough coming from, baby. Medicinal, baby. Medicinal Colorado, baby. Where do you see tonight's video? I'm back in the cut. As long as you never say yeah, you won't have to worry about saying no because you couldn't say no. You stood out here and uh, you told the world you got a videotape of uh, some other guy and you doing your drugs. You stood out here and told a lot of other things. You also said, told, if you do not know how to finish it, don't start it. And you reached that point long, long time ago. The king of New York pumps you on the mic and off the mic, petrified, and that's all the public can say. They rock with me often and say he's scared shit. It's, you're the easiest cat to find on this avenue, man. We ask anybody where's Richie, they point it right to you. Boom! So, you know, he is just so scared, and the public knows it. I reign supreme. I thought you were leaving, dog. How many times did you say you were leaving? 
I ran back in because I forgot the big sack of weed. You're going to see in that video game later. I ran back in because I forgot that Colorado 3-5 a Girl Scout cookie. I'll be back. That's nothing but a $50 bag down here. But nevertheless, Randy, I forgot the weed. I had to come back in. But don't worry. I left the video game rolling. You'll hear exactly what happened. You'll hear me come back down into the radio room. The king of New York City. Food, I guess. Bros of diet shit. And then poor Eddie, poor Eddie always thinking that he could step on me. Poor Eddie always starting to tell me a story while him and everybody else hears me on the key talking to him. I love it, bro. I love when I catch that in the video games. It says, Junkie all the way. They're going to wind up married to each other with a couple of kids. Dollar against it now with your mammy. That one never going to happen. See, uh, I, it's very apparent you don't know who I am or don't know anything about me. And to me, that's a good thing. But nevertheless, dollar against the now, baby. <laughs> and Foster, I told you four years ago when you came out your mouth wrong, a dollar against the now with your whole mother. Look at you four years later. Was Richie not right? I'm back in my quiet chair. Okay, quiet chair, come to the uh, CVS over here, Manhattan, and I'll take care of all your problems. I'm sorry, Mr. Enforcer, Mr. Strong Arm of the Law, Mr. 21 and 0. You started this fight. Don't think anybody out here is going to help you finish it. You you begged for this fight, and you got beat, and now listen to you. You look at Clarkson, baby. All your boys came, and you hear them cry every night when they go home. The only one that didn't come is you, and you're supposed to be the man that's going to make it all happen. You're a joke out here. Fag boy. Hey, Eddie, I'm 10 7. I'm gone. He's all yours. Yo, man, you see, he didn't key up when he thought I was gone, man. He don't key up till he hears me. He don't lick till he get the dick. I'm clear. Oh, good. Hey, 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 dog, man. Are you doing that Santa Claus this year? Well, I'll tell you what, Eddie. Unless I'm one of your junkie boys that always talks about things he's going to do and don't. Unless I'm not true to my nature. I do believe my $80 from my uniform was already spent. I do believe the new Santa suit is right there across the room. And I guess you'll have to wait for your every year Black Friday video. Oh, the king of New York is club. I made two of them right there. You hit the clock from McDonald's, 3 p.m. in August. Yo, 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 ask him where these videos are on his channel. Ask him, ask him. Some, yo, if anybody can show me a video he made on Utica for three or four months ago, oh, I'll go crazy. Yo, I'll pull everything down, dude, everything. You you won't hear me no more. I'll make a video while I'm taking the station down and breaking everything in a thousand pieces. That's funny. 250 from... Switch, you won't hear Richie. That I can promise. All right, guys, you don't have to hit the switch because uh, Richie's going to the avenue. The king of New York City. Oh, the king, baby, the most talked about and feared man. So, Mr. Enforcer can try to show and prove to your fine public otherwise. Dollar against the dollar with your whole mother. Four years later, who reigns supreme? Tell Richie I said good morning. Tell Richie. Yo, who's that, Duke? Time of day it is. When you're up. Hold on a second. That was you that said we're gonna wind up married with kids? He doesn't know if it's morning, noon. Oh, man, my apologies, dude. My apologies for what came after that. My Listen, my deepest apologies for what came after that, Duke. But I got a funny feeling a little voice in the back of your head, though, a whole lot better on what's gonna happen when the eyeballs go on that one. Richie, little Richie Cappy, I'm out, Duke. Peace. Well, then, you know what? I, I'm glad and I deeply apologize for what you're going to hear in the video later.
Hey, Alibaba, you want some Skittles? Oh, shit, he said taste the rainbow. <laughs> hey, two, five, a blow. Alibaba. Hey, Alibaba, you want some Skittles? Sounds like a whole bunch of out there. All they do is complain about each other. One's action, one to fight. Hey, Alibaba, I love everyone out here. Always going on the side in the rocking chair. Ali Bob, I got some Skittles for you. I heard you like Skittles. Put a nickel on his head. Taste the rainbow. Taste the rainbow. Taste the rainbow, Alibaba. Taste the rainbow. None of you can't talk normal out here. Nah, it is not normal. That's my buddy out there, Alibaba. There ain't no fucking one of those guys that uh, fly around on a magic carpet. Yeah, he flies, alright. Oh, shit, so he works at 7 Eleven. Yeah, I think that's the 7-Eleven I got poisoned at, man. Alibaba served me that cheesecake. Oh, shit. <laughs> I got food poisoned for three days, man. I, I, it looked like, uh, sound just like Alibaba working at one of those 7-Elevens. I think it was him. Damn. Well, you know what, Eddie? I learned my lesson. That never happened again. I never got that sick in my life, man. I was thrown up for two days. Actually, for one day. The, the, the second day, I'd had no food in my stomach to throw up. But I was feeling that shit, man. And I went to 7-Eleven, and the guy that served me, well, actually, the guy at the cashier sound just like Alibaba, man. Just like him. I wonder if that was him, that dirty dog. <laughs> yeah, hey, man. All right, man. I'm out of here. I'm going on 7 uh, seven, man. 7 3 is out there in the band. Everybody have a good weekend. I'll catch you next week. All right, Eddie, you have a good one, man. Get home, get home safely, drive carefully, man. Get, I'll talk to you uh, next week. You have a good one. All right, have a good night. Have a good weekend out there. With that, I'll be 10 6, 10 7, and I'll watch my series Slash on Netflix. I'll catch you guys later. Oh, man, this guy just called and canceled, man. Now I gotta wait an hour before I go back out to the app. Thank God, Junkie Boy going 10 7, huh? Well, you know, you, you you and your merry crew could have actually tried that or tried to, uh, actually, you know, you just couldn't try it. You were too scared, but don't worry. You'll get your chance again. Don't worry. Two flower blow wishes I was bending his bend over, buddy. But he did tell the whole world out here to watch me do a lewd sexual act to him, the fucking homo. In case y'all don't know what I'm talking about, the name of that video is called uh, Little Johnny's Trip to Punky's House. The five minute zone. Mr. Two Flower Blow comes clean with his own lips. Did you hear him this morning, Melissa yelling in the background, you should leave me alone, he's creating RFI? Did you hear him with the fag words and the penetration? Yo, everything on his mind is homo. Go listen to, you know, it's nauseating to have to listen to some of his morning shows, you know what I mean? But uh, I do not go watch his uh, fake uh, Barclay videos or his, uh, his unboxings or his uh, instructional videos. Like, I wouldn't go watch his videos. Uh, he wouldn't go watch the three of them that night. And he says, yo, man, go watch Running 3. So when I did, I got ready. I got I clicked on number two only. Uh, you know, the kid don't believe me. The kid don't believe me, man. His cop friends don't tell him, yo, Richie ain't lying. Richie's device in history is don't click on your videos. The king of New York, my quad. Ain't that a bitch for a bitch for a bunch of one and Latino homo bitches? You know LES really stands for Lower East Side Sissies, right? Oh, cracky. 
or lots of extra sucking. <laughs> and if I'm lying, I'm dying, baby. Yo, BK, where you at, man? BK, I gotta get out of here. What's your 20, do? No contact, Brooklyn kid. You're a sound king. The hole in the wall, non Brooklyn, Brooklyn CB shop. The most total, most everyday fleet man on and off the band wave. Richie RC127 at the helmet around, aka Nemesis in the dark realm. I'm back. Wow. Silence of the Lambs!